Hello, this is Dr. David Green, Education Director for Premier Pain Specialists in Chicago. Today's topic is the non-operative treatment of adult scoliosis. Adult scoliosis involves rotation and curvature of the spine due to spinal degeneration. It's very different than pediatric scoliosis. It's typically painful, whereas pediatric scoliosis is not. It's stiff and therefore not responsive to bracing. Usually adolescent scoliosis is flexible and therefore does respond to bracing and it often causes both back and leg pain. Back pain from all the arthritis and leg pain due to nerve roots getting pinched from the arthritis causing spinal stenosis and leg pain. Adult scoliosis occurs for two reasons. One is it may be an exacerbation of pediatric scoliosis. If you have scoliosis that has a 40 degree curve or greater at the end of adolescence it's going to usually get worse. Studies show about one degree per year. That doesn't sound like a lot but let's say you're 20 and it's 40 degrees and then one degree per year and then you become 70 years old that's 90 degrees so it really can get get bad over a course of decades the second way it occurs is new, new due to spinal degeneration so you don't have scoliosis then you get into adulthood you start to get disc degeneration that then leads to abnormal facet motion in the back of the spine and arthritis develops asymmetrically and then nerves can start to get pinched and so you have arthritis from uh, leading to degeneration and curvature. So the symptoms of adult scoliosis, the arthritis from the facet degeneration can lead to significant back pain. All right? Patients can also get muscle weakness and aching because they're trying to stand up straight and they have scoliosis and they're exerting this extra effort. Also one can have buttock and leg pain from the spinal stenosis that develops. Treatments for adult scoliosis usually start with simple things, over-the-counter medications such as anti-inflammatories and Tylenol, then going up to prescription medications such as higher strength anti-inflammatories, neuropathic medications like Lyrica or Neurontin, narcotic medications and then maybe topical prescription pain creams. Physical therapy uh, can be exceptionally helpful along with interventional treatments. Interventional treatments may include facet injections, where the needle goes right into the facet joint and steroid and numbing medicine is placed. Uh, this can, medicine can stick around for weeks to months. Trigger point injections just subcutaneously can help with the muscle achiness uh, and weakness. Here you have a medial branch block which is numbing and steroid medicine around the joint where these little tiny nerve endings supply sensation. So you're basically stopping the transmission of pain signals and helping with pain relief and that can be done bilaterally at several levels. If that works and wears off then you can have a radio frequency ablation which basically heats up these medial branch nerve endings, deadens them and that can provide pain relief for over a year. Epidural injections can work well for the pinched nerve aspect of adult scoliosis where you have the spinal stenosis. Well what are the outcomes? Over 90 percent of those with adult scoliosis can achieve a satisfactory level of baseline pain without any surgery. Between the treatments for back and leg pain most patients don't end up needing surgery. It's an elective quality of life procedure and should definitely be a last resort. I mean you may have to get a whole spine uh, fusion or you can end up having just a lower spine fusion but the complication rates are well over 50 percent okay and they're long procedures sometimes they need to be staged over a period of three days okay so you really need to take this into consideration the top non-operative pain management in the greater Chicago metro area is through premier pain specialists they accept over 50 insurances, providing over 25 treatment options with the board-certified award-winning doctors who average over 90% success rates. Visit us online today at ppschicago.com and then call us for more information and scheduling at 847-519-4701. Thank you very much for watching.